manager of Grand Lake, Colin Cover, says the competition is one that is very important to the company who has an interest in youth development. He says one of the goals and objectives of the company is to allow young people to display their academic capabilities. Provide a forum where young people who might not necessarily be gifted in sports or as some other can display some other talent apart from the sports. And so we're really just providing a forum where academics can be displayed and uh, good debating, research and reasoning uh, are, are facilitated. And so that's the reason why we really do it. For example, that the more the coaches stay the same coach, this, this, the schools that seem to do well are the ones who have the coaches who stay with the program because as the coaches themselves improve each year, the students improve also. So we're really seeing that and that's the reason why this year we, we made quite a bit of an effort to, to um, incentivize the coaches, you know, because we want them to stay with the program because as they improve, the students, we notice the quality of the debate and improving because the coaches are improving each year. Roshan Lendo of the Hisbar Secondary spoke of their victory. I would say that this is one of the best days of our lives. We've been waiting for this, working hard. A lot of sacrifices had to be made and at the end of the day we, we really enjoyed this this experience. Alia Paulet, representing Bishops College, who had hoped for a different outcome, spoke of the challenges faced. I think maybe the cross examination could have had more challenge in it. Maybe how the information was presented in the cross examination it might not have been clear to the judges. So. To get to the finals, a lot of work needs to be put in. Bishop's College coach was Wendy Andrew. Bernadine Knights, coach of the Proud Champions, stated areas where deficiencies were found. It's been a lot of hard work, um, doing the research, making sure that the children are knowledgeable on all, on the, on all of the topics that we would have um, had to debate on. Um, as long as they're informed, then they're able to cross-examine, respond, rebut, etc. So that, that is the main thing. One of the strategies, we use very young debaters so that our team remains stable. So we don't lose debaters along the way as the years turn over. And we work hard, we spend hours researching both students and teachers. And, um, Teamwork, you know, everybody helping each other. And I think these are some of the things that has propelled us to where we are, victory at last. We are so proud that we have made history for Karakou and for Hillsborough Secondary School. Though Bishop's College did not cop the coveted title, they believe it's a win-win situation as they both celebrate this historic event for Karakou. Renee Toussaint, GBN News.